What's up everyone? I'm going to watch what a vegan teen eats in a day. She's called Pippin Jardine. What the fuck is that? Alright, start your day off by losing minerals. Clever. <laughs> nice. Sugar and anti-nutrients. Cool. Hey, hi, hello. My name is Pim Jardine and uh, welcome to my channel. with something called a fit belt. So I'm going to be running up this hill right here. It goes for like 0.25 up, 0.25 down. Um, and I usually run Why? Like four times. Who are so you running away like from? What's the point? It's not exactly 0.25 up. Yeah, I'm going to go now and I'm going to die. If somebody told you that this is healthy, then they lied to you. All right. <laughs> it's just completely goes against human nature. If you're vegan, you're not getting any saturated animal fat, and uh, if you work out, then you lose whatever you had left. It's very, very destructive what you're doing. Very. I think I'm going to go home, I'm going to drink some water, roll down these goddamn windows. I actually brought this so that I don't ruin my mom's car. That's pure starvation if you work out and drink water. So All you do is pee out even more nutrients. Fresh and clean now. I ended up eating like half a watermelon because I don't know if you guys have had watermelon. Watermelon also is pretty taste. much nothing. Like the best thing you could literally eat in your entire life. But I wanted to show you guys these like savory scones that I made the other day. I'm starting to recipe test for my next second ebook, which I'm super excited about. It's gonna be all like really balanced meals that are just more filling satiating and super nutrient dense but still delicious and still yummy and still like what nutrients makes us think of i don't know of other stuff but i made these savory scones the other day i haven't perfected the recipe yet because this was the first one and i do want them to be a little thick it has more anti-nutrients so than like anything I else it's so freaking good i've never made savory scones before uh, and i like fuck. just kind of winged it and i just threw a bunch of stuff into a bowl and what i've been doing is putting coconut cream on top which I know might sound really weird, but it's like butter. I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna just pour Because you want butter. Nothing is like butter. Coconut butter has no fat soluble vitamins. There's no way to imitate it. All you do is show that you're mentally ill and want to eat something else. Yeah. Everything in here is actually from our garden besides the tofu, like even including the sauce and stuff, which is super, super cool. Savory scones with some hummus, aka hummus. I ended up just making lunch right now so that I can- If you want something savory, then you want meat. That's so just human nature. Right now, There's no arguing with that. We're simply in denial. Just stop. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> what the fuck? <sighs> Garlic is super toxic, so is ginger. Alright, what we have here is bok choy. That's actually super toxic because of the goitrogens. For a teenager to eat that? Absolutely stupid because it will mess up your thyroid. Just irresponsible to promote this because so many teenagers are watching and believing that greens are healthy for you. They're all man-made. They don't exist in nature. Walk in the forest. Look for this. 
you will never find it <laughs> because man cultivated it. You're eating an unnatural diet. No human ever in history has ate this way. Sweet potatoes, there's pretty much no use in eating them. Some starch which turns into sugar in the body. Beans, phytic acid, it doesn't let you absorb any minerals. <laughs> Avocado, some plant oils, useless. Hummus and hot sauce, of course, because you have to mask the horrible taste of these man-made plants. Just another shitty meal. Of Every slave I likes the like shit. I'm very excited for that. Alright, this girl didn't get over 50 nutrients in this vegan day of eating because plants don't have over 50 nutrients which are only found in animals because it's part of our natural diet. Without these micronutrients, you're not gonna simply die, you're going to slowly degenerate. And this is why I was talking about promoting it for teens because they're very vulnerable when it comes to malnutrition. Whereas people who are older, they save up a lot of nutrients because they eat animal foods all of their life. Teens nowadays have a pretty shitty diet to begin with. So if they go vegan, then they degenerate even quicker than any adult. Maybe there's even some kids watching this. Thanks for watching, guys.